Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm coming from you straight from my bed. About two months of quarantine. Just trying to hang in there. Still haven't had any unemployment success. Anyway, wanna make it a productive day. Gonna finish getting, just get myself together. Get up, get about, get out, do some things, see some things. So I'll take you guys with me. All right, let's go. Hi guys, welcome back. So I just got finished um, getting dressed and getting ready, getting my makeup done, putting my wig on. And I'm actually really, really proud of myself because I made this uh, as I did. So handy, so crafty. I made this myself. So I'm really excited about wearing it. I haven't really laid it down the proper way, um, but I'm not really too bothered. It's raining outside here in Ohio. Um, but this is what I'm wearing, just a button down denim denim situation okay got some leggings on wearing some pumas so we're ready to get the day started let's go hi guys i have made it to the first destination and i am really upset because yesterday was a beautiful day like the sun was out it was like 70 plus degrees it was a perfect day the birds were chirping um and today is raining and it's pretty cold and it's supposed to be raining for like the rest of the week so i was like man i should have did this yesterday but i'm not gonna let that stop me i'm gonna continue to have a beautiful blessed day and to bring the sunshine to up to, to today um so the first stop is a hair store. I just need to get some more caps for my hair. And that's it because I've already been here a couple days ago. And I don't even know if this place should be open. I'm not really sure what the regulations are, but I'm still about to go up in here anyway. So let's go. So they basically didn't have what I needed. I just need wig caps and they're all sold out. Um, so I think I'm just gonna ditch the hair store idea for the day and just head to the pharmacy. Yeah. Hey guys, I totally lied. I'm at another hair store because I really need some wig caps. Your girl needs a wig cap, so let's go. Guys, I am back with success, yay! I got my wig caps, I also got some um, wraps to put around when I lay my um, baby hairs down in the morning, so I feel pretty successful. So that just goes to show you, you never keep, never give up, you just keep on going, keep on pushing. Um, so next stop, pharmacy, and then after that, I think I wanna stop by um, the hospital, just the lab, just to drop off some blood work for my doctor. So, so far, pretty successful day, yeah. We are in line at the pharmacy and there was only two cars ahead of me. That means it's a good day because normally there's 15 cars in the line. So we're moving right along. All right. 
just went to go get my prescriptions. Let me pull up window. But real talk guys, um, my insurance will be probably ending soon. So I try to talk with my pharmacist to see when they will allow me to refill my prescription. So if you're in that same situation, just be sure to call in, speak with your pharmacist to see when your insurance will allow for you to renew it and see what they will pay for. So it's worth a shot for sure. Thank you. Hi guys, so just got finished giving blood at the hospital at the lab and literally every single time i go and give blood i have to give like six or seven vials of blood just for one of my doctors um so i do have lupus lupus is the chronic condition that i do have but thank you lord it is a pretty manageable condition for me it is not very severe um because lupus has a really wide range of symptoms and severity in terms of how it affects um, people's day-to-day -day life so i'm one of the lucky ones and i'm very blessed uh, but i have not been doing the right thing so my doctor definitely wanted to check in on my blood work which is the reason why i had to give so much blood so now that that's done um it was kind of weird because everybody is going through the extreme coronavirus um precautions which makes things a little bit interesting um but the, the branch that i go to is a pretty local family um branch here at cleveland clinic which is a large hospital network for us so it went pretty smoothly so now that I got that crossed off the list, I think I'm going to head to some place to get something to shop. I need some eggs, I need some groceries for the house. All right, guys, see you later. Making a pit stop at McDonald's because I'm hungry as hell. Well. So for the final part of my day, I actually made it to Target. So this is the place where I decided to get my groceries because the grocery store was actually jam packed. I'm, I'm gonna be doing a voiceover for this because I was wearing a mask in the store for coronavirus precautions. So if I were to be speaking, I'm gonna sound crazy. <laughs> so this will be a little bit easier. But my favorite part of the store, which I know is a lot of people's favorite parts of the store, I gotta spray my cart first, is gonna be the seasonal section, the dollar section towards the front there. So a lot of cute stuff for summer holiday, red, white, and blue. You know, July will be here before we know it. Cute little candles if you want a picnic. Just some office items. There's a pillow. Let's play. <laughs> the rest of the section you can see it's been kind of hit a little hard, so, um, but predominantly is it stuff for kids there. You can see some tumblers. And this stuff over here was actually pretty cute. And I love the color scheme. Cute colors. So while I'm shopping the rest of the store, I'm going to speed it up a little bit because I really shouldn't even be through these aisles anyways, but you know how Target works. So coming up on the shoe section, you already know Target has a bunch of really cute shoes. But those signs were actually telling the people not to sit on any of the furniture, not to really touch too many items. So it's basically telling people to be as minimum contact as possible. That's what those signs were telling people. But they have a crazy cute selection of sandals per usual. Target always has great shoes. Look at that cute outfit in the back white loose white leg pant really loose tank top it was in the plus size section but i've been able to kind of make some of those items work especially if you don't mind wearing things oversized
another thing that I love about Target is their cart selection. They always have a really great fully stocked cart selection. So um, I recently had a coworker of mine that has retired. So I wanted to give him a happy retirement card, which I found. And you guys will not believe, but I left that card at Target. Like I paid for it, I scanned it, and I left that bad boy right at the checkout. Look how cute. Hey guys, I'm finally done shopping. I made it through all my errands for the day. Yay! I got everything that I needed with the exception of AAA batteries. No, AA batteries. But uh, I think that I'll just wait until I can find some that are a little bit cheaper than $10 a pack. Um, but I think that this is basically going to be the video for today. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. I'm going to try to put up another one pretty consistently and try to make them almost every single day. Don't hold me to it. Um, but hopefully you guys will like it please don't forget to like comment subscribe check out some of my other videos down in the description box and i'll see you guys next time bye